Welcome to Shree Learning Academy. Our today's topic is dictionary attack. So let's get started. Introduction to dictionary attacks. As we live in a digital age, ensuring data security is critical. Many safeguards are in place to protect digital information, and one of the simplest and most common is the use of passwords. Yet, as secure as a password-protected system may seem, it remains susceptible to various types of attacks. One such method is the dictionary attack, which is often overlooked but can pose a serious threat to password security. What is a dictionary attack? At its core, a dictionary attack is a method used by cybercriminals to guess a user's password. This method uses a list of possible passwords, similar to how a dictionary contains a list of words. Instead of trying random combinations of characters, which is the principle of another hacking method called brute force, a dictionary attack uses a curated list of potential passwords. This list can range from thousands to millions of entries. One might wonder why an attacker would use a dictionary of passwords instead of trying all combinations. The answer lies in the fact that humans, unlike computers, do not generate truly random combinations of characters when creating passwords. Humans tend to use familiar words, common phrases, or predictable sequences of characters. This pattern of behavior is precisely what dictionary attacks exploit. The psychology behind passwords. To understand dictionary attacks' effectiveness, one must first understand the human psychology behind password creation. People, in their attempts to remember their myriad of passwords, often resort to using simple words, common phrases, or personal information such as names, birth dates, or favorite sports teams. These are all easily guessable and would likely be included in the dictionary used by the attacker. In this sense, dictionary attacks can be thought of as psychological warfare, preying on human predictability and negligence in password security. How dictionary attacks work The list used in a dictionary attack often includes stolen passwords, valid words from dictionaries or books, entries from online encyclopedias, and even combinations based on the target's personal information. This means that if the target person has a habit of using their dog's name as their password, and this name happens to be in the list, then the attacker has a high chance of cracking the password. An example of this would be an attacker trying to gain access to an individual's email account. The attacker might know that this person is a huge fan of the Star Wars franchise. Therefore, they might include words like Star Wars, Darth Vader, or Yoda 2023 in their dictionary. If the individual used any of these as their password, the attacker could potentially gain access. The process involves systematically testing all entries from the list until a match is found. The passwords from the list are tested in their exact form, including case sensitivity. Thus, a dictionary attack could quickly identify a password like password123, but it would struggle with something more complex and less predictable. The role of websites like crackstation.net Websites like crackstation.net have created a formidable arsenal for those wishing to conduct dictionary attacks. They offer large password lists for download, containing billions of passwords gathered from various sources. While these websites are ostensibly intended for use in legitimate cybersecurity operations, they can be misused by malicious actors. Penetration testers, ethical hackers who test systems for vulnerabilities, often use these aggregated password lists to identify weaknesses in a system. By attempting to break into a secure system using these dictionaries, they can discover if any users have weak or easily guessable passwords. However, the same lists can be used by attackers with less noble intentions. Countering Dictionary Attacks – The Importance of Password Security Knowledge While dictionary attacks are fast and relatively straightforward, they have a low success rate against targets that are aware of password security practices. Users who choose complex passwords, those that include a mix of uppercase and lowercase letters, numbers, and special characters are less likely to have their passwords included in a dictionary list. Furthermore, using a longer password increases the number of potential combinations exponentially, making dictionary attacks even less effective. For instance, a person who uses the password C0MPL3XP at SSW0 Road is already at a significant advantage. While this password is a phrase and thus potentially guessable, the combination of characters, including uppercase letters, numbers replacing certain letters, and special characters, makes it a lot harder for an attacker to guess. The Role of System Administrators and Ethical Testers The best defense against dictionary attacks is a strong password policy, enforced by system administrators. Such a policy should require users to create complex, lengthy passwords and change them regularly. 
This lowers the chance of a password being guessable or included in an attacker's dictionary. For ethical testers and system administrators, using password-only lists for testing is recommended, avoiding any personally identifiable information that might be misused. Regular testing for vulnerabilities, including the execution of dictionary attacks, can reveal weak spots in the system's security, prompting timely rectification and user education. The job of system administrators and ethical testers also extends to educating the users. Knowledge is the most potent defense against dictionary attacks. Users who understand the importance of strong, unique passwords are less likely to become victims. Regularly conducted workshops, seminars, or even email reminders about the importance of password complexity and variety can go a long way in fortifying security. Final Thoughts In conclusion, a dictionary attack is a simple yet effective method used by attackers to crack passwords. It leverages human predictability in the common trend of using simple, easily guessable passwords. While dictionary attacks pose a serious threat, they can be mitigated by proper password security practices, regular testing, and user education. Remember, a strong, complex, and unique password is your best defense against a dictionary attack. Thank you so much for watching this video. Do check out the written explanation on our website and don't forget to take this quiz based on this video, the links are in the description box below. Subscribe to our channel to watch more interesting videos. If you have any doubts, do let us know in the comment section and we will try our best to solve them for you. For private coaching, do contact us by visiting shrilearningacademy.com or on WhatsApp. See you in the next one.